Hello, VR junkies. Yeah, back in Skyrim VR. Currently uh, on my way to Bleak Falls Barrow because I have a mission to complete there. You can see it's um, snowing, which is not unusual in Skyrim, but uh, especially in, in the mountains, it's not unusual at all. Point is, I'm up high and yep, this looks seriously, seriously epic. And there is Bleak Falls Barrow, stop that way to the right. And you see, I have a bow, it's a hunting bow. Not a bad uh, weapon. Depends which kind of arrows you use as well, because different arrows do different damage. I'm using iron arrows at the moment, but I've also got steel arrows, a bit better, but I don't have as many of them. So I'm going to keep with my iron arrows and see what I can do. Now because I've done this quite a lot, I know exactly where the uh, bad guys are. There's one somewhere just up there on the left. That's roughly where I'm looking. It's an archer type guy, so I can take him out with a stealth shot, because stealth shots do double damage, which is very handy. That's good. But I need to be able to see him first. The problem is, I need to be careful because this guy's up here, up in this kind of uh, ledge. And so I need to sort of sneak around and wait for him to appear before shooting him. Or I can just charge him. Yeah. Both work. Occasionally one of the best things you can do is actually, uh, here he is, reveal your presence. Big ol. Because revealing your presence draws them out, but you, they, they know you're there, they just don't know exactly where. So you're still kind of hidden. Guys up here to the right somewhere. If I can sneak up on them. Ah, there you are. He spotted that? me. Not quick enough though. Ha ha ha! Think so? Oh, best. You won't get the best of me. Thank you. Your dog meat. More arrows, excellent. Gold, steel, great sword. Yeah, maybe worth taking. Oh, sorry. Get my arrow back. Ha <laughs> ha! Thank you. And you know, that's, a, that's a pretty crap shot. It's not a kill shot, surely. Jeez. I think it should be better than that. So, yo, oh, Blue Falls Barrel. Rock and roll. Now, as always, before you enter any structure, sneak mode. Thank you. Two guys up here. Now the trick here is one. Nope, missed. One and two. Thank you very much. Look at all these corpses. Skeever tails. Yeah, let's give us some of that. Gold. Uh, what do you got? Gold. I am arrows. Thank you very much. Let's keep our tails again. They're good for alchemy. 
Uh, yeah, I'm looking up someone's. Yeah, okay, that's a bit wrong. Okay. <clears throat> more skeevers. More skeever tails. Excellent. Now, if it was a bit um, wounded, I could sleep here and uh, get some health back. But I'm okay. So, oh, lock picking. Right. This is this is kind of esoteric. Um. <clears throat> we have to do is turn the pick and then see if it works. No, it doesn't. So turn it a different way. Does it work? Yeah, it does. Okay, but not quite. Get more. Nope. Back the other way. Bingo! Lock picking 101. Thank you very, very much. Let's delve a little deeper in here. Mm, spider webs. Yeah. yeah. You get all these little urn things, and they usually have goodies in them. You don't know what it's going to be. It could be gold, it could be a, could be a potion if you're very lucky. I think it's kind of random what it, what it gives you. Nothing. Empty. Okay. The main thing is, you sneak everywhere in this game. Because your skills progress up, and as your skills progress up, your level goes up. It doesn't matter what, what skill is, it's just, it goes up. So sneaking is always handy. But you only level up sneaking if there's somebody who could detect you but didn't. It's kind of weird. So you have to think, right, okay, sneak fast or sneak slow. Slow will get you there very, 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 very slowly, but um, if you notice someone around and you sneak very, very slowly, you can creep up very close behind them. And every single time you do that, okay, there's somebody there. Uh, I'm so sure I mean, right, if I can get closer. Nice oh, walking away. Okay, sneak increased. <clears throat> if I can increase my sneak skill. Oh. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, we should have to kill himself. Right. Um, <clears throat> if I can increase my sneak skill, uh, it will increase my level. Eventually. Uh, right, okay. This is. Uh, little puzzle thing, so snake, snake, wheel, so, yeah, anyway, we've got, so that's why he died, because he didn't go snake, snake, wheel, right, so, yeah, screw you, dickhead, worked for me, didn't for you, because I read the environment, yeah, I was saying, uh, sneaking, yes. Um, sneaking is important because... Another skill increased. <coughs> Every skill you increase uh, moves you closer to increasing your level, which means increasing your perks and various other things. But also, as you increase levels, you can increase your stamina, your health, or your magicka. The more stamina you have, the more um, the more you can carry. But also, the more you can hit with uh, things like the mace and the, the axe and whatever. The sneak allows you to. Uh, thank you. Yeah, um, sneak allows you to get a double da a double damage hit. Or possibly triple damage because uh, I've done that with. Um, I can see, find that right skills. Uh, where is it? Uh, da, 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 sneak. Right. Okay. Various perks. So twenty percent harder to hit. Uh, uh, noise from armor reduced. Very handy. But that one. Okay. Sneak attacks with one damage. One six times damage. Yeah. Pretty fucking awesome. Oh, so we've got, uh, where is it? Uh, 
Nope, that one, that one. Right. Sneak attacks with bows do three times damage. So that is seriously awesome because sneaking with a, sneaking with a bow is just brilliant, man. You just, before you even they can even detect you, you from very, very far range, you can get a big hit on them. Now, if you're good with a sneak, yeah, I mean, being able to do six times damage would be better, but yeah, it's kind of hard. This is a bit with the spiders, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is not fun. Okay, let's go get some spiders. So what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna poison my weapon. That means the first thing I hit is gonna take a big bit of poison damage. And with that, Yeah, burn, burn, burn. Thank you. Don't let it get me. Get me down. Get me down. Yeah, I, I, I think that's that floating skeleton thing. That's kind of weird. I think it's a graphic. Get me down. Anyway, that's enough. Yeah, welcome to Skyrim.